Hello, wonderful, amazing video game type people, and welcome back to Massive Chalice. Alright, so, last time when we left off, we had made a pretty badass team. We've got Lash Lord, Daniel Brockner, on our side here, so I'm quite excited to put him into action. And I believe, if I remember correctly, we had just encountered the first of the advanced opponents. The advanced seed. Ooh. That is dirty. Alright, let's see if we can do this. So, first, let's quickly take stock of relics that we have. Uh, Jesse has a relic. And, uh, oh, there we go. We've got a new relic, chosen, chosen by Shavk. Or with Shavk and persistence. Okay, cool. That's easy enough. Barbo. I guess we just uh, move this way and uh, see if we can hurt people. Point blank shot from close range. Very interesting. It does uh, significantly more damage, but only has a range of one. Ha. Huh. Knockback shot. Oh, right. Enforcer. Oh, Rebecca's an enforcer. Fire shot that deals reduced damage and knocks the target back. Very interesting. All right. And, of course, stealth, but not right now. That's interesting. Okay, so we have our, our enforcer. Pretty good. Oh, and patriotic. Holy snapple. That's awesome. That is awesome, awesome, awesome. Rebecca Zhang. Wow. Alright. Well, I suppose we could line up for a charge, I think? Maybe not. Oh, Shadow Jacks don't charge. Okay. Well then, let's just, uh, let's just have a heyday shooting them all. I don't really want to move Rebecca too far forward. Well, she does have a bone bar bow, and there seems to be a good chance that she can line this up pretty well. Now, will that actually work? Because if if you can do that, oh, 18 to 22. Oh, I can't say I I approve of that. Also, what are the items? Just want to check. You've you've probably got I think. Yeah, steady hander on Rebecca. That's fair. Oh, I do so wish that uh, she could actually go for a kill or something. Oh, well. Uh, hardly a bad shot, really. Lash Lord Brockner. Hmm. Does Brockner... Brockner has a flask shot. Oh. Interesting. Well, I think... What is it? 86 <laughs> percent. That's pretty impressive, all things considered. Now, I will move you a little bit closer there, bud, so you have a nice shot. Bash Lord Brockner. Going for the mad kill here. Good riddance, you deplorable beast of pestilence! Very nice. Alright, I wonder... Yeah, we can get that hit in, so that's pleasant. Uh, knockback, no need, but we will get that kill. And then the other one can go to, I think, reasonably Jesse. Yeah, something like that. I'm going to hold off on Jesse just for a second and go for that first. Nice, we want to level up his, his weapon. I'm, I'm sure that that, when those weapons level up, they become amazing. Well, hopefully it's a kill shot. Very good. Uh, put the boom striker in the middle there. I wonder if we can boom strike over top of perhaps something. Any of these rocks here? Might very well be able to boom strike. Oop. All right. So let's see how we do in terms of shadow jacking. Ah. It's nice that the majority of our team can actually stealth. Oh, there we go. 
Another advanced seed. does again here stats plus one hour. okay no bonus to speed though but significant accuracy and evasion boost that's kind of nice no need to rush in oh all right couple advanced seeds pack hunter what is pack hunter Oh. Increased evasion, strength, intelligence, and dexterity. It, oh, improved stats when all allies are nearby. That is interesting. So they, they kind of get... Uh, they're starting to get traits now. Maybe it's just the advanced ones that get traits. Maybe it's just a difficulty thing, too. I don't know, but that's... I mean, that's something. All right, who do we want to get the experience on this one? Eh, I guess it doesn't really matter, does it? No barbos anywhere? Nope. Okay. Well, then you go ahead and you kill that seed. Unless... We'll flip it around, I think. We'll flip it around. I always forget about that that stun explosion. Maybe I need to start thinking a little bit more about that. It's a little bit frustrating. Whoa. Hello, what is that? Oh. I'd entirely forgotten about the wrinklers. Did they always look this terrifying? Holy cow. Holy cow. Alright. I agree. It's time to test out the Perilous Core. <laughs> oh, goodness. Alright. Watch. Watch and be odd. Yep. We just launched a nuke. Loving it. I think I imagine that the Perilous Cores will be very useful later on. Hello. You ready to die? You ready to die today? You little seed. What about, what about you? Oh. Man, my clicks are a little bit off today. Oh, no. That's not cool. Can you get a shot in? Yeah, that's pretty not cool. Huh. Well, I suppose we go ahead and just hope for the best. Ugh. Oh, come on. No. How? How do you not see that seed? Rebecca, you're being a jerk. That's my angry face. We're supposed to see that seed. Oh. Alright, get a free throw and do not miss. Alright. Um, I suppose you'll be fine there. Yeah, that's what I expected. Very good, very good. I'm liking these higher evasion stats significantly. Let's charge forward. Oh, oh, you got a lot of movement. Minus four. Nothing we can't handle. Nothing we can't handle. Though I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm gonna use you. Oh. I thought up in here somewhere there was a. Oh! There and there. Hello. We're going to shoot through the rocks. No more perilous core, but I think 
We have some pretty nice odds. For some reason, the laps has just <laughs> worse evasion, I guess. So that worked out nicely. I'm doing a, a shit job of distributing the experience points where they need to go. So I'm not I'm not a fan of that actually. Um Yeah, let's do it. I want to get some more experience for Shock. Good riddance, you deplorable beast of pestilence. That's terrifying. I hope they can't reach us. Oh my. You know what? They probably can. They probably can. They can totally reach us. Uh we've got an enforcer. Oh, goodness gracious. Ah, oh, no! God, that is awful. Okay. That's fine, that's fine. Knock back, knock back. We could use a knock back shot. Ha! Alright. What's this, point blank? No point blanks. But you could knock back the wrinkle. What is your... Yeah, you're not gonna kill it anyway, so you might as well knock it back. Which one's probably going to get to us first? Yeah, okay, looks like you only got one anyway, so go for it. I will take it. Oh, and it's stunned! So, you know, that much was good anyways. Might have been better if it was the other one. That's fine, that's fine. Okay, we're moving up. Bring everybody in, alright. Lash Lord. Yeah, you gotta make that move over there for me, please. And go ahead. Alright. That works, too. Oh, thank goodness. You gonna... Oh, they're moving. Wow. That damage is going on up. You under the effects of Pack Hunter still? No, I don't think I don't think he is under the effects of Pack Hunter. Uh, no clean shot. Okay, get rid of it. Nice. I think we just leveled up the weapon. Oh, maybe we just leveled her up. That, that works too. I am quite curious. Crop duster, increased sight and attack range. Done. Dead eye. Uh, let's see. I think the crossbow. Well, level six, that's insane. 30% crit chance. Wow. Alright, Brockner. Don't muck this shit up. Oh my goodness. What did I just tell you? Is it just me or are they just turning out to be infinitely more enemies on these maps? Um go for the kill. For the future! This is right, for the next 150 years or so. Probably less than that by now. What, did I use your free throw? Ah, oh, shoot, I did, didn't I? Alright, alright. Um, we could... Quite... Um, you know, weaken... Ah, uh, I see. Well, that's the one we need to kill. There's no chance of that happening. Let's level you up. Increase damage when attacking from stealth. That's interesting. Slam the caper into the ground to damage all nearby characters. Also interesting. I'm gonna go with sneak attack. That's kinda neat. Shovk the chosen one. What are you gonna do? You gonna... Yeah? Decent odds? Okay, okay, I see, I see. So no kill there, but we could finish that off with this one. Leave the seed. Use you to lob a... Yeah, let's do that. Go for it. You're gonna do, you're gonna do me right there. Okay, you've got a 100% chance. And you're not at all being optimistic here. So please, by all means. Thank you! Okay, and on this side of things, I want you to, uh, yeah, I definitely want the Art of Relic to get the kill. Oh, too bad we can't line that up anymore. I suppose that's okay. Take that shot. Nice. Very nice. 
these upon your end. Yeah, this, things are certainly getting a little bit harder. Wow, what was that? Rebound plus three. What? Was that the armor or some such? Man, those guys look terrifying. Okay, what is what is this? What? Find caberjack armor? No. Sneak attack. Rebound. Armor knocks back melee attackers and provides bonus protection. That's kind of nifty. Totally did knock him back. Alright. Yeah, I think you could easily get that kill. Let's go for it. Very pleasant. Hope the weapon's doing well. Alright. Now we get to shoot. Whoa. That's pretty nifty. Go for it. Oh, did you see the way that one went down? That was pretty awesome. Woo. Thanks, Lillian. What is... Lillian's actually quite low level. Holy cow. But that weapon is going up real nice. Get that to level 5 soon. Alright. And this might finish it off. Who do we want to get this last kill? Potentially Rebecca? Yeah, those... Wow, those two are really high level. Jesse and Daniel. Oh. Um, yeah, no, let's give it to Rebecca, if we can. She's the youngest. Oh, it doesn't look like we will be able to. That's a bit of a bummer. Right, like, if I go... If I go there... Nope, no shot. Okay, well... That leaves us with this, then. Daniel's the one. Endgame! No! Ah! It's not over yet. Okay. Okay, okay. Move her back up. And, uh, Lillian, yeah. There we go. Found him. Oh, so close, but not close enough. Okay, well then, let's give that to... Uh, that kill to Rebecca. A knockback shot. No, it won't work in this case. I do somewhat worry about... You know, because these are just advanced seeds. So imagine how okay. hard... I was worried for a little bit, but... <laughs> I imagine how hard the advanced everything else is going to be, and particularly, I'm kind of worried about advanced, uh, what are those things called? The big things that spawn cradles, advanced cradles. I mean, they're going to have, you know, a lot of health. We're going to need those perilous cores. Our heroes have prevailed in the Cinderlands. Corruption has eased in this region. Very good, very good. All right, only a couple level ups. That's okay. A lot of experience, though. Wow. Stand ground or blinding shot. You know what? Blinding shot might have its uses, especially later on. Stand ground, gain a bonus to max hit points and immunity to knockback effects. Mmm, that also sounds pleasant. Fortify nearby heroes with armor rolls. I wonder if these are actual abilities or, like, that I have to use, or if it just works. Oh well. I think shoot and scoot. Yeah, shoot and scoot sounds pretty cool. Let's go for blinding shot, though, for now, just to test that out. And that leaves us with Lillian. Throw items. Yes, please. I don't... Is Lillian young? I don't think Lillian's very young, but, you know? The ability to throw those bombs. Heroic babies are bound to the keep that they are born in. At age 15, they are transferred to the capital for active duty. Uh-oh. It only went down one. Ooh. We might actually end up losing a region at some point. It's, things are getting a little bit tougher. Four years until Hero Discovery Boost. Oh, what is this? Might take some thought. I'm glad I don't have your job today. Relics in time. Gerald Kavoris has barged into the throne room and can't stop babbling. 
I'd had the most wondrous dream. There was a full moon, and I was standing above the chalice, and I jumped in. But instead of being transported to a battle, I was sent to another time, and I found an heirloom for my family that I thought was lost ages ago. It was so real that... Your mind blanks out as you realize the moon is full tonight. What do you do? Ugh. Okay, what does this all mean? Dim-witted, hardy, quick-study, pessimistic, patriotic. That's... awkward. Huh. Okay, I guess pessimistic isn't that bad, but patriotic is good. I don't mind pessimistic. Uh, in fact, that's probably good. Dim-witted, hardy, quick study. Well, he's certainly not awful. And he is patriotic. I don't know. But he's a quick study. Allow Joe to transcend space and time in search of this relic. Uh, I mean, if we lose him, but, you know, whatever. First, yeah, let me... Let me give the guy some skills if he's going to actually do this. Put it down. Ooh. Hmm. Another uh, stealth caber jack or whatever. A shadow jack. That's what they're called. Mm, armor knocks back melee attack and some prize bonus protection. Put it down. Uh, uh, put it down. Best defense is a good offense. Go ahead. Okay, whoosh! <laughs> Gerald jumps into the chalice and is whisked away in an explosion of energy. As the smoke clears, you hope that the journey doesn't take too long. Here's hoping, buddy. Here's hoping. Jesse Zhang has died at the age of 60. Alright, the Zhang relic is going to Rebecca, absolutely. Yeah, there'd be no reason not to. That I can think of, anyways. Daniel? Oh, Daniel's bountiful, so no. Hawkeye, bear strength, quick study, style word. It's oh, all the best. All the best of the Zhang family. Zara? Infertile. Ugh. Quick study, pessimistic. Yeah, see, I guess I don't know, because the reality is that Rebecca would make an amazing. Uh, you know, keep person. <laughs> Daniel, too. I'm gonna go with Daniel anyways, because of the, uh... Bountiful, I guess, but... It's just a bit of a bummer, because those traits are amazing. Hawkeye, Bear Strength, Quick Study. Anyways. Things are getting tougher, so we're gonna... Give it to Rebecca. I can't stand the thought of dying at home. If death is the only certainty, then I'll be the one choosing the particulars of it. The goal to which we all aspire. Hmm. Right, House Alexander. Maxwell Zhang. Dusk Twilight. Who's Dusk Twilight? Is he any good? Bountiful and sickly. Nope. Silas Kavoris. Brainy. Bear strength and quick. Oh, that's... Shockingly good, though. Shavk. Oh, yeah, no. Shafk is not at all. Nope. Nope. Hmm. Marcus Lahan. Nearsighted, nimble, arthritis. None of those things are good for us. James. Asthmatic. Nope. Nope. <laughs> nope. Oh, my goodness. Silas? The only other option for the Kavoruses? Uh... Bountiful slow. Yep, yep. We're not we're not doing slow, so it's gonna have to be Silas, I'm afraid. Oh my goodness, is there no one else? Is there no one else? Frederick? Nimble sl quick slow learner, wily and patriotic. He's kind of old, man. Frederick's not gonna live very long. Stefan. Uh also pretty old. Yeah, no, that's gross. We'll uh I guess we'll give you James Brockner. Oh, not James. What was it? <laughs> Silas. Silas Shovk. Brainy, bear strength, quick trank. Okay. Confirm. Thanks. We need some fresh blood. These books have seen better days, but we have translated a whole three volumes of ancient chalice text, and we discovered a secret chemical recipe to call upon better heroes with the chalice. Very good. Now that you've done that, discover some new heroes.
I want good blood. That's really young for our standard to die. That's kind of kind, that's kind of a piss off. Who's patriotic? Uh, no, 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 no. Somebody else. Come on, don't be like that. Hey, stalwart, patriotic, arthritis. Uh, Sandra Kavoris. Yeah, it's not bad. She's got patriotic and stalwart. Two good things. Both of these guys are way too old. Sandra's not going to last very long anyways. And until then, absolutely. Let's go with Sandra Kavoris. Charge. Fury. Confirm. Sandra. As our stalwart and patriotic. Standard. Thank you! Sad day for the Regency. As long as the seat is open. Why is everyone dying so win. damn young? Holy cow. Alright, and we need a new Alexander. Strong will, bountiful, quick, rebel, optimistic. Sounds amazing. You will make decent babies for us. And many. And many. Alright. And quick. Ooh, that's wonderful. Alright, Silas? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a great idea. Oh, aren't you glad that your wife died? And now you get to marry a new wife. I think they will make wonderful brutalists together. Dusk, unfortunately, is sickly and has arthritis. So we will not. But, no, together with Silas, I think the Alexanders will blossom into a wonderful family line. Uh, into a very quick family line, also. Go ahead. Make babies. I expect many babies from that. Keep. A small group of Chalcetune citizens have been found and added to our heroic roster. Alright, what did we get? It looks like these five okay yeah all level five so that's pleasant okay we got uh, what is it two alchemists two caber jacks and a hunter asthmatic slow learner faint-hearted yeah strong-willed puny and slow nope low fertility <laughs> can we have a little luck with this please oh my goodness Siegfried Siegfried can be used. Oh my goodness. Ugh. Siegfried is the one. We're gonna get the Mary Siegfried off to someone. Uh, that looks like about it. Just Siegfried. That's shitty. Blunderbow. Cradles produce a disgusting amount of junk when they create a seed. How about having the crossbows where hunters do the same thing? Such a weapon would pack would pack quite a punch at close range. Oh, okay, so it's like a shotgun. A shotgun bow. Is that really something I want? Shotgun bow. Bone shell armor. Bone shell armor actually sounds really nifty. Um... In terms of items, I'm not sure. Wunderpants. Weapons. Wunderbow. Oh, ten years. Wow. Um. Pillar ram cap. What if the explosives from ruptures could be weaponized? Adding explosive tips to cabers would push enemies around a lot farther from our, than our standard models. Eh, that might not be bad. I don't know how I feel about generating pillars. Elite training, though, while slow, sounds pretty damn useful. I think I'm going to go for elite training. I'm not sure which one, though. Alchemist or crossbow? Guessing a shot versus knowing a shot is the true test of crossbow mastery. With elite crossbow training, there is no guessing, only certainty. Reduce okay, let's get elite crossbow training. Not sure if I'm doing the right thing, but 
We'll see. Max on out of there. Hopefully we get into combat real soon that'll reduce the amount of time research will take by like 50%. Stop killing my heroes, time! Alright, Shaft, nope, nope. Eostagon, dim-witted quick arthritis. <laughs> that works fine. Throw them in there. Reduce the current research time by 2 years, 20 days. Done. Thanks. Territory attack. Oh, no. We're gonna have two. Oh, that's insane. We're gonna have two with, uh... And we have to pick this one. 25% reduction of current research time. That's amazing. Man, we have lucked out. We just lucked out. Okay, so we're gonna take this one. I'm just concerned about these two, then, because they're both gonna... I've... Oh, yeah, look at that. We're getting three attacks instead of two now. Holy snap. That's not good. What happens if it reaches three? Do we just lose it? Good God. We need that one. Increased fertility, yes. Cradles and bulwarks and whatnot. Now, hold on. Did I did I do that right? Go back. I'm pretty sure I did that right, but I just want to... Right. Wrinklers, bulwarks, and cradles. So, hopefully, no advanced opponents. Things are kind of really amping up here. Alright, obviously, Last Lord. All, basically, all the relics get to stay. We get to throw in one more person. And this time, I'm very excited to let you know that we're going to try something new. Oh, veil Armor. What does Veil Armor do? Made from lap skin allows hunters to hide anywhere on the map. Alright. Slightly less evasion, plus one. I'm excited. Let's try all the Veil Armors. Now, I assume it only works for the Hunters. Well, that was Hunters, yeah. That's fine. Wow. So, it's just the equivalent of having camouflage. It's not bad. I wonder what it'll look like on the actual map. Wrinklers, Bulwarks, and Cradles. Oh. It might behoove us, I think I'm using that word right, to equip a bone bar bow instead of what we currently have. Also, Lillian could consider a perilous core. Yeah, I want as many perilous cores as possible. I'm pretty sure she can throw items. It increases their area of effect. Oh, good. Okay, Throne Perilous Core. Uh, trick Shot Perilous Core. Do you also get to shoot items? Rebecca? Rebecca's got Anvil, so that's pretty badass. Steady Hander. Another Perilous Core. I'm, I'm so down with just giving everyone Perilous Cores. We're going to nuke the hell out of this map. There are cradles, so we're going to need to nuke the hell out of this map. You know it, I know it, you know. You got to believe, man. I'm excited for Chosen to level up a little bit. I think we're good. With the health file. Now, who else? Preferably, um, you know, someone that throws. Nimble, optimistic, oblivious, brainy. Well, actually, Jessica's not bad. Probably has pretty high damage. Increased dexterity means better accuracy. I think. Decreased intuition. I don't think you need intuition. That low fertility bit sucks. That doesn't mean you won't make a decent... Um, you know... A decent person throwing bombs everywhere. Certainly better than someone who's slow. Um... Yeah. Nimble, Hawkeye, Flincher, Stalwart. Not awful. Decent, but no. This one calls for another Alchemist. Absolutely. Absolutely. A Boomster. Oh, no. Ooh. Ooh, what is that? Oy. Yeah. I'm feeling Jessica on this one. Siegfried? Oh, I guess we could use Siegfried, couldn't we? What does nervous mean? Decreased accuracy. No. No, Siegfried. We're going to go with Jessica. 
Yeah. Unstable carapace armor. Oh no. Back and slash. This is a brutalist, right? Extra item slot. Yeah. A uh, steady hander. And a potentially a health vial, but I think an experience scarf should. I'm curious to see what how that's gonna work. Steady hander, experience scarf, I'm fine with that. No point in perilous core because you can't throw it yet. Um, you know, decent stats. Really high intelligence, so that's helpful. Um, okay. Two bomb lobbers. Okay. And we're trying out the new Veil armor this time, so very exciting. Whew. Let's deploy and hope we've done everything we can. Man, this game is getting a lot harder. A lot harder, let me tell you. Okay. Deploy! Are you sure you wish to deploy with this vanguard? Yes, I think so! Try to keep a diverse vanguard. Hero classes all have strengths and weaknesses. Why, thank you. Onward! We don't want to keep the cadence waiting. This looks like a funky new map. I wonder if we blend in. No, we don't blend in at all. <laughs> Veil armor looks ridiculous. And I can't use it anyways. Okay. So I'm gonna save here for now, but there you go, folks. Look at her look at her lovely new lineup. I say new lineup. I there's always a new lineup, but I mean typically. Wrinklers. Cradles. Oh, the whole gamut. This is gonna be wonderful. Okay. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time on Massive Chalice. Bye.